and we're back to learning Premiere Pro and this time I'm going to show you a strobe light effect. So get a simple clip right here, position your marker where you want the strobe effect to be applied. So I wanted to start here, then right click in your project menu in your item adjustment layer. You can set the size right here but by default it has the same as your sequence. Then drag it into your timeline and now you can resize that. So I want to have it as long as my clip below so that both end at the same time. Now go to effects, type in strobe and then drag and drop the strobe light on your adjustment layer. It's right here, we can see that in effect controls. If you can't find these menus, go to window, effects and effect controls. The two most important are the strobe duration and the strobe period, both are in seconds. And you cannot adjust only one, so they are somewhat paired. For example, let me set the strobe period to 0.01. You can see there is no strobe anymore, so you always have to adjust the duration and the period as a pair. Good values to start with, for my experience, would be 0.08 and around 0.1 for the period. It makes sense to blend it a little bit with the original. So in this case I use around 50%. And you don't have to use white, that's just the default, so you can make it red. Or you can use this eyedropper tool. Let me show you this again. You can just click here on this color swatch and there's the eyedropper tool as well. I pick, let's say this color, then I confirm it. And now we've got this purple. And this is how you can create this strobe light effect in Premiere Pro. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.